and he's got Manjunath for company. Well fielded. That's what Kerala strikers need. Don't need to give any easy singles away. Let's just remind you how Rajiv got out. It was a very hard strike, but went straight to long off. And uh, fortunately for long off, he didn't have to move very much. We'll take a look at it a little later. Kodieri comes in. Vinish Kodieri holds very straight and fairly mean. Bowls it quickly as well. Big hit to long on and taken. An error in judgment from through. Went straight to long on a couple of steps forward and a nice catch to bring Keller strikers right back into this game. Well played. 11.2 overs gone. It's 101 for three. Strikes for Kerala strikers, one after the other. Rajiv was the first man to depart, followed by Dhruv. Both decent catches in the deep, one at the long off and the other at the long on region. Flat catches, never easy to take, but the fielders have held on to their catches. And let's have a look at the wicket. Well, Manjunath now, the new man uh, in, in fact, both are new Karthik. Strikers. Oh, well, a bit of a misfeel. It was struck very hard, mind you. But they go for the two. They do. It's a good pick up. But not a very good throw, sadly. All right, let's go back and take a look at those sharp catches you mentioned. There we are, Akash. That's throw. He'll be very disappointed after being so well set. Didn't quite catch hold of it. Arjun took a couple of steps too many, almost overran it and eventually took a good catch overhead on the ladies delighted oh quite brilliant a short extra they might still do well they do try and go for the two but uh, very good work by maddy 100 and 104 for three after 12. Couple of wickets oh, no, for no, no, uh, the no, no, Kerala no, no. strikers. Karnataka bulldozers uh, started strongly. They were uh, looking ominous at one stage. Have lost a bit of their way in between. It's going to be interesting to know where they finish from here. 10 and over will take them to 183. 12 and over will take them to 199. Karthik is the new man, the right handed batsman. He's a very good bowler. That I can assure you, they're very well in Ranchi and uh, not an incompetent bat. So, Karnataka Bulldozers, Bulldozers still have an opportunity to take it into the high 100s. But uh, what's happened in the last 15 minutes should encourage the Kerala strikers if they can somehow bottle this up to 160, 165, they'll have a pretty good opportunity at chasing that. And there will be nerves. The minute two new batsmen out of the crease, there's nobody settled to guide you in. That's Godre Gion. The one watt project uh, that CCL3 is associated with. They make the most energy efficient appliances. And energy is something that uh, players need to spend and these companies need to save. Anything that's environment friendly, we're all for it. Or will leave a better world behind for the younger generations. So the architects of the Kerala strikers has come back. Gopan bowling now, Kodieri from the other end. That's a pretty audacious run. And had the throw been cleverer, you never know. I suppose they knew that Kodiari is not particularly sharp at cover. Still don't see the smiles there. Oh. The left-down spinner has pulled things back nicely. 
and supported well by Khodiar at the other end. Bhopan is uh, into his third over. He's conceded just 16 runs in 2.5 so far. He's taken a wicket also. Well, not only does he bowl well, lefty orthodox always have, a, have a generally a nice flow uh, rhythm to them. He also batted very well in their opening match at Kochi. In fact, saved the match for them. Low scoring match. Came up with a 30-40, I remember. Oh, no, no, Cut away no, no, sharply no, no, behind point. And a welcome boundary for the Karnataka Bulldozers. 13 gone. It's 113 for three. A bomb chicka. Wow, wow, wow. And 13 for 3 after 13 overs uh, before the start of this over. Run rate is still about 8.66 and over. We have Archana standing uh, in the dugout area. Let's see who she has with her. Thank you very much. Well, I do have with me three angels from the Kerala Strikers. There's Bhavna, Purima and Mamta, all dressed in three different avatars of the Kerala Strikers jerseys. Now, tell me, how did that work out? Well, um... This jersey of mine just ended up being there in um, in my bag just two days ago. I didn't even know that they had designed one like this for me. So it's totally working and I had this red, this yellow color you know, thing to put on. So yeah, so I'm so glad that I have a different design this time. I'm tired of wearing this one. Like, <laughs> <laughs> still got it on. <laughs> no, but you've come in a nice oh, salwar oh, no. kameez. Tell me, how did you get around to doing that? No, I just thought, you know, it's anything for our team, something different, something nice, because we're going to rock. I can see that all of you have made an effort come out here, you know, of course, the Karnataka Bulldozers is a strong team, but you guys are fighters as well. Tell me, how much are you girls contributing to their success right now on the field? Well, it's the energy, it's the cheering. All three of us are sitting together and yes, do, giving yes. our boys the best and we can. And from the bottom of our yeah, heart. Very yeah. true. Yeah. So much of positivity alone. Yeah. I mean, it's just like, we know lose, you know, they just have to enjoy the game. Okay, so all you girls are like brand ambassadors of the Kerala Strikers. The boys out there in the heat in Chennai. We know about the heat in Chennai, don't we? It's really hot. So if they win, is there like a little, you know, gift that you'd like to give them? Maybe something to eat or something. Have you guys thought of these things, you know? Yes. A little extra effort? <laughs> I've decided to push them into an ice cream oh, after they yeah. can't go back. Yeah. But it's a lot better than yes, uh, it was in Cochin though. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's definitely a lot better than Cochin, but definitely if they win, we have a, the night is going to be really, really long tonight. Yeah. Well, we are certainly looking forward to that. Thank you, girls. Enjoy it and keep your fingers crossed, okay? Yes, yes. Everything else. 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 Thank you. And it's back to you guys in the commentary box. Women from uh, God's favourite country, that's Kerala. Beautiful place. And are uh, at this that's point it, in time producing some good cricket Beautiful on the field, cricket. especially the fielders. They're throwing themselves around. They're putting uh, everything that they have. They know how important this down. game is for these uh, these guys and for this team. Yeah, they're putting life and limb behind. Their efforts edged, and their bad fortune in the day continues. Not for the first time has an edge found the boundary line. Karthik will take it. So will the dugout. And it's a bomb chicka wah wah moment. It doesn't matter how they come, as long as they're coming. You can see the disgust, despondency on uh, the bowler's face. But that's all that you can do. The girls are dancing. A bomb chicka wah wah moment. Another good looking shot. There is uh, some cover in the deep. Will they go for the second? Yes, they do. Finish at 1 2 2 for 3 after 14. Yeah. 